Hello, welcome. My name is SlugMTG, and today we're going to be talking about a tweet that Wizard sent out on Monday, July 13th. There will be an update to the banned and restricted list impacting the following formats Historic, Pioneer, Modern, and Popper. I'm very interested in the Popper for obvious reasons. I'm way too poor to be playing any of the other formats. I don't care about them, but Popper. That's interesting because the last band that we got was Arkham's Astrolabe on October 21st last year, 2019. And after that first initial month of the Astrolabe ban, the meta kind of settled and Flickertrod became the new boogeyman of the format, but Wizards haven't done anything since then. So I'm not sure what changed now, or maybe it's been close to a year and enough people have complained about going up against Flickertron that they've decided to do something about it just to shake things up and make sure the format doesn't get stale. After reading the tweet, I went around, looked at a bunch of different cards that people are saying should be banned, and I have tried to gather the initial thoughts in this video, and then on the 13th, we can all look and see that Nest Invader got banned and be extremely disappointed. Okay, I really hope that doesn't happen. It better not happen. I will send an email. Obviously, the deck that needs to be hit right now, everyone's talking about is Flickertron. It's a deck that is very oppressive. It's not fun to go up against. So the big talk is that, is this the time the Tron lands are going? I think that's the big ban that a lot of people are talking about. If it's not the Tron lands, then it could be Ghostly Flicker and Ephemerate. And then a lot of people are saying that if Tron gets hit, then Mystic Sanctuary needs to go as well as Mystic Sanctuary goes with Control decks, whose biggest matchup is Tron. And if Tron goes, then the control decks have a very good chance of being the next broken deck and Mystic Sanctuary is very easily abusable by them. So these four bands, these are the cards that people are talking about. So the Tron lands, Ghostly Flicker, Ephemerate, and Mystic Sanctuary are the most likely targets. Some other bands that people are throwing around that I label as spicy bands. It would be interesting. I don't think they're very likely, but it would be interesting. So some other cards that I see thrown around are Stonehorn Dignitary, Expedition Map, Displace, Tragic Lesson slash Deprive. We'll get to why they're grouped together in just a moment and Mold Drifter. So I don't think these are very likely as these aren't necessarily the key cards in these decks. Stonehorn Dignitary is the card that enables Tron to lock people out of combat steps. It would be interesting. I'll get to why in just a little bit though. Expedition Map obviously targets the consistency of Tron. Displace would only be banned if Ghostly Flicker and Ephemerate are banned as well as people consider this to be the replacement. Tragic Lesson slash Deprive. These are the cards that pair extremely well with Mystic Sanctuary and make the combo, or I guess the value engine, very hard to stop. As with Tragic Lesson, you bounce up Mystic Sanctuary, you play it again, you grab Tragic Lesson back, and you're having this loop of where you're just drawing cards over and over again. Same with Deprive, where you are guaranteeing having at least one counter spell every turn. Mold Drifter would be another one that's interesting as it's just a very good value creature when paired with Ghostly Flicker and Ephemerate and it's something that can be abused, although it's not nowhere near the forefront of the discussion. Most of these cards, not a lot of people are saying that they need to be banned. So the bans, everyone's targeting Tron with this one and I think rightfully so. However, some people are calling for unbannings because they didn't say they were banning things they said they were updating the list which means something could get unbanned but i don't think that's very likely the reason i think that is because there hasn't been a lot of talk about unbannings prior to this tweet now that this tweet has been sent some people have been talking about unbanning certain cards but my guess is that since wizard sent out the tweet the cards that they are banning or unbanning are pretty much set in stone because there has been no significant talk of unbanning anything no buzz created around the community for certain cards i don't think there's really much to unban and the talk of unbanning certain cards now that the tweet has already been sent is a little too little too late so so to sum things up, Tron, most likely something about Tron will get the ban hammer. 
maybe Mystic Sanctuary, since if Tron takes too much of a hit, then these control decks might just run over the entirety of the format. I don't think there's going to be any unbannings, but for the remainder of this video, I will be talking about my own opinions about these bans, not necessarily what other people are talking about, but my own opinions. So if you want to dislike the video, this is where you do it. Although I will warn you, I've seen at least four popper YouTube videos, so I'm pretty much an expert. Take my opinions with a grain of salt. I'm just one guy. So I think out of all these bands, I think the Tron lands are the ones that need to go. It would kind of be sad to see them go because they have been such a staple archetype for Popper for years at this point. And to see them finally go would be kind of sad, but they abuse otherwise fair strategies. Flicker is a very fair strategy, just maybe not when the person using it has 10 plus mana every turn and can flicker three to four times a turn. I think if Ghostly Flicker gets banned, Familiars will go along with it, which is a deck that a lot of people love. People love Familiars. It's a really cool deck. And if you ban all the Flicker cards that Tron is abusing, it's just hurting other fair decks. And I'm afraid it would push people away from the format. And true, getting rid of Ghostly Flicker and Ephemerate would power Tron down up until some other card inevitably comes along that Tron will once again abuse. And then that card will have to be banned. So I think the Tron lands, it's time for them to go. I see banning other things in place as putting a band-aid on a bullet wound and I just don't really see many other options that would provide a really good fix that doesn't take away from the format overall. However, if Tron goes that's such a power vacuum that goes along with it. And I think control decks would dominate the format. And if Tron goes, more bands would need to take place to bring balance back to Popper. People talking about Ephemerate needing a ban, I think that would be a very useless ban. Don't get me wrong, I think Ephemerate is a very powerful card. It might be too strong, but right now, Tron is only running one, maybe two copies of this in their deck, and banning that would do absolutely nothing for the format and nothing would change. However, one ban that I think is interesting would probably be the safest ban is Stonehorn Dignitary. That is the card that Tron flickers to lock decks out of combat phases. And if they ban that, it would make Tron extremely vulnerable to aggro and creature based strategies as they would need to change their deck to pack in a lot of removal or just a lot of life gain and just hope that they can make it through the onslaught of creatures. This would be the safest ban, I feel like, if Watsy just kind of wants to ban one card and leave everything else be. Stonehorn Dignitary might be it. Although if I were in charge of it, I think Tron would need to go. But that's going to wrap up my quick thoughts. I just wanted to get something out, kind of take the thoughts of the community, put it into one video, put it out there. Let me know what you guys are thinking down in the comments below. But anyways, thank you guys so much for taking the time out of your day to watch my video. I really do appreciate it. But now, if you'll excuse me, I'm about to go start funeral planning for the mono green Tron list in my popper battle box. Bye.